All right, we have a very special guest on Luminous News uh, today. We have Ryu Lattes. Hi, I'm Ryu Lattes. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> we also have a big box of little guys. And we're going to do some box opening for you. Yes. Oh, wow. Look at this. All this right. is exciting. All seven plus four types. What All does that right. mean? So there's seven, uh, I guess, regular figures. Oh, Oops. Oh, no. <laughs> All right, let's do it this way. Let's dump them out. Not, maybe not dump them out, but I'll try and use my little tiny fingers in here to pull right. them out gently. Yep. There all we right, go. Let's... We got one box. Okay. All right. I think that's all we need because um, normally these are like blind uh, blind boxes, but if you ordered through the G Forever uh, group orders, um, you can get a full set without having to go through all the mystery ones. That would be the best in most cases for me. I hate mystery <laughs> boxes, but I love opening things. Yep, so here's the box, and we can show this to you in a moment. But it looks like pretty cool uh, box that we see all the different cameras. Um, we have, uh, looks like 99 here, 96. Uh, is that a, it must be a, maybe another nine, 96. It tells you right in the box, uh, 96, 99, Yes. Yeah. Oh, 68. And then this is the um, 2006, the, uh, the father one. So it's pretty cool. And father Godzilla. Yep, or Gamera in this case. Him? Yep, this is all Gamera. But I thought he wasn't in Godzilla. No, there's no Godzilla. Oh. <laughs> this is all Gamera. So... <laughs> they look like Godzilla. <laughs> yeah, they're little turtles. <laughs> See, my, my non-knowing anything about this series no worries. is showing. No worries. We're, we're going to get you in, into <laughs> into Godzilla, Gamera, and all, all sorts of um, Daikaiju. So, looks like we've got Virus, Gauss, 95, I think, Guiron, and looks like another Gamera here, 1999. So, 1999 seems to be uh, Kay and Lin's favorite, and a lot of fan favorites. It's actually my favorite, too. All right, let's see if we can get this opened up. Is he kind of like the Batman to the Iron Man? You know, like how Godzilla would be Iron Man, the other one would be Batman. They're of different universes, but they're kind of the same idea. Is that like... Kind of, yeah. So Gamera... He's kind of like the sister of yeah, so the idea Ga of Godzilla. Exactly. So it was a different company that made Gamera. So I think what happened is back in the 60s, um, that this company uh, originally died. They start um, here on this side and go that okay. way. Yeah. There you go. All right. So the company Daiyi probably saw the success of Godzilla and they wanted to make their own uh, giant monster movie. How successful compared to Godzilla was it? I think it was very popular amongst kids because he was, in the 60s he was uh, titled the friend of children. Oh. So uh, Yeah, that looks friendly. <laughs> he looks real friendly. <laughs> so let's, uh, let's point this down to the, uh, the box there. All right. Open the box up. So we have a bunch of mini boxes. We got a bunch of little prizes in here. So do you yeah. have all those extra boxes for the show you're selling at? Yes. So uh, yeah, we're going to be heading out to G Fest in Chicago. So it'll be a lot of uh, camera figures and Godzilla figures from Easy Hobby. All right. I guess we'll go through. How many are there? The 18. I mean, so we'll go through and find them. Oh, you can see them all in color on the box. Yeah. Pretty exciting. Uh, right. Yeah, I'm gonna grab those from you. Do I sure. to peel anything? Yep. I'll zoom in on the, the box. I'll do that. All right. Who's the first one? Who's the very first one that we're gonna open? It looks like it looks like Gamera. Looks like a turtle boy. Do yeah. I open the plastic? Yeah, go for it. Oh, look at him! All right. Which one do we have? Looks like, is it the same guy right there? The yeah. big one? He's a, yep. Oh, he's the trash. Oh, sorry. <laughs> <laughs> Looks like Gamera 1999. He sure does, and he came with uh, a little rocky stand. Oh, look at that. little stand, too. A little baby stand. Let's go. I think it has information on the bottom of the stand for him too. Let's oh, see. Oh, nice. Oh no, just credits on the front of the box. Oh, so the little cracks. Does he stand on it? Oh. Nope. It's tipping over. There must be a way for his tail to position it where it doesn't fall over. Yeah. Because there's no pegs. There oh, we go. Oh, there you go. He got it. 
of this trash out of the shot. Yep. So there's Gamera 99. I'll spin him around a little bit. We'll get some close-ups later. <laughs> <laughs> he wants to be held. Yes, little turtle. <laughs> All right, little guy, we'll put you aside. Let's check out the next box. I'll put the stuff back in the box here in case you decide you want to put them sure. back in the same box. We'll do. Thank you. All right, who we get this time? I think this is the one that you picked, because I was holding mine. Okay, yeah. And I think it's the one you pulled out. All right. I feel like I'm having all the fun over here. <laughs> I've done a lot of unboxing, so I think uh, as a special guest oh, for you. I is he the same guy? Do we have the same one? I don't know. Mm, maybe? Maybe. No, it's different. He's different? I think he's different. Let's oh, see yeah, if he can... Oh yeah, his coin at the bottom is different colors. Let's see if he can spot the differences. Oh yeah, wow. So the, uh, the even the base is different. The base is a different color. Yeah. It's like a brown earth. Isn't this cool? I didn't expect this. Let me see if I can focus on it. Nope. Are you sure he's not the same? He's not the same. 1996. You're right, you're right. The eyes yep. are very different. <laughs> but yeah, I that mean... That one goes on this one. He yeah. stands better. He stand, He does stand better. Nice. Maybe he's weighted a little differently with his shell shape. Possibly, The yeah. shell on one is more spiky and this one's more rounded. Yeah. So 96 is a, a fan favorite. Uh, I think a lot of people love the... Is that this one? This one, yeah. This is the Gamera that fought Legion. So we do have the prototype of Legion with us. So we can see how big Mother Legion is. I'll move this guy here for now. So this is the Eggmon Mini. I call them the Mini Eggmons. So um, we can put these two together. So in the future, uh, Legion here does come as a two-part set with another uh, 96 camera with a lot of, um, I guess, uh, cuts in bl green blood. So green poor, blood. Poor camera. <laughs> Yes, and we do. We also have Iris here to pair up with the 99 Gamera. So let's move these two aside for a moment. All right. So we do have the prototype of Iris. Iris is one of my favorite non Godzilla villains. Uh, I think it's a she. Um, has a lot of uh, tentacles and the glowing uh orb within the uh, like the head there very nice coloring yes um and a lot of cool um colors on the chest so in the movie um iris here has a lot of uh, glowing lights on on the body yeah i can see all the like the shiny gem like additions to the ends mm -hmm. of the spears and stuff too yes yeah so in the movie uh, iris does uh, shoot i think laser beams from these like gem orbs um within the tentacles, so it's pretty cool. Wow. So yeah, I can pair up Iris with uh, Gamera 3. <laughs> <laughs> and I believe the um, the Iris uh, Deluxe set does come with another version of Gamera 99. Uh, again, I think, not sure if it's a burning fist, but there's definitely some blood marking, some battle damage, I guess you can call it. So these little guys should also be in the box? Yes, so they should be somewhere in, in the box. And some of these mysteries. Yes. All right. <laughs> this one's different too, aren't Let's you? See. Let's see. This if one might different. be the same. Might as be the this same. One. Yeah, this one's spiky boy. Should I put okay. him back yeah, in? Yeah, we can put him back in. That way you can still sell him. Yeah. <laughs> uh, yeah, I'm gonna guess there's gonna be some duplicates. Right. Yeah, I think this is more than 11 in here, so we'll try to get the, the set. All right. Next up, who do we have? Let's see if we can get a mystery Gamera or Kaiju. This might be the second one I opened. He's got the bigger eyes. Uh-oh. <laughs> yeah, and this is the second one oh, we've already opened. 96 again? Okay. Yeah, for sure. Cool. I'll put the little tab back together as intended. Thank you. Put it back 
in there. There we go. I think this one's different. Oh, there we go. Got something new. Maybe? Yes. That's Papa, yeah. Papa okay. Gamera from 2006. All right. I'm digging that brown base. It's definitely more unique than a gray one. Yeah, you don't see brown too often. Yeah. So this is what it looks like. <laughs> Oh wow, he's got a, he's got like a green monster slash across his eye. Yeah. Some blood on his chest. Yeah. Look at this one. He's really uh, gritty and dark. Spin him around. He stands a lot nicer. Yeah, he d sure. So they, must, they does. must vary on their weight and like. The I would think so. Probably like this. This probably has more weight on the back of the shell. Whereas the other one probably has more on his head. On his head, yeah. Yeah, because his so, head is kind of posed, kind of out. Yeah, so he does kind of lean forward a little. But yeah, so this uh, this uh, particular gamer from 2006. This is the Papa gamer from the opening scene. Uh, I think he's more of a tortoise, so we can see um, kind of like the shell difference between the Heisei Gamera and I guess the Neo Heisei, I don't know. So it's not the same character evolved like Godzilla, this is like different parts of the family of... Um, actually these are the, supposedly the same character and this is like a new, um, kind of like a new movie. Mm -hmm. So uh, I think it's disconnected, I think it's its own movie, so uh, it's like another Gamera. Oh, okay. Yep. But yeah, as uh, Ryu pointed out, there's a slash on his eye showing a little bit of green blood. So we'll have a nice uh, zoom in photo later. And what's really cool about Papa Gamera here is uh, just like Toto, um, he has that pattern on his chest. So, yeah. Real serious looking. Yeah. He has even worse posture than me. <laughs> you know, I sit on a computer like this all day. Uh -huh. He's kind of like... <laughs> oh, boy. <laughs> <laughs> Definitely the most alien thing about this man is his stance. All right. <laughs> yeah, so we don't have... I don't think we have Zudis in this set, so... Let's... Who's that? Which one is that? Zudis is a... Uh, it's kind of like a... Like, almost like that frilled dinosaur. Oh, the, okay. Like the spitter in the movie. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So um, I don't think he's he, he has made it to the Eggmon series yet, but probably in the future. All right, who's next in our mystery boxes? So there's 11 different kinds in here? Yes. So there's uh, four chase figures. And, uh, Ooh, seven. this one's different, Andrew. Nice. <laughs> oh, you got one of the kaiju. Ooh. And it's another brown base. I'll let you open that one. Oh, okay, so sure. Yep. Yeah. Yeah, so, I'm just too excited to open this one. Yeah, something different. Oh, Ooh. underneath the base looks like there's some Japanese English characters. It's going through all the different movie titles and um, because Dai was bought out by Kadokawa, so we'll see the copyright by Kadokawa. Look, Look at, at this him. guy. All right. Check out Guairon. Look at him. He is cute. Looking like he's got a saw sticking out of his head. Yeah. Yeah. Like, just like a knife, right? Yeah. <laughs> yeah, very cute little guy. He reminds me of that anime that just came out, Chainsaw Man or whatever, yes. with the big saw sticking out of yep. his head. Yep. <laughs> and this definitely, oh, I was going to say definitely probably stands better, but he is also very top is he heavy. I think he's leaning forward, right? Yeah, yeah. it's the head. Yeah. Yeah, so it looks like the Godzilla ones. Oh, but if you pose it just right. Yeah, you can get him to stand. I think that probably helps with the cracks in it, like it kind of like leverage yeah. against it a little bit. Yeah, that's true. Are there little paw prints, or it's just not kinda... that I can see? Yeah. Okay. So I'll just have to angle it right, and you can get them on there. So I'll have to pose them properly. All right. You can probably do it better than me. <laughs> All right. You got it. it takes a lot of patience. <laughs> All right, who else? Do you we pick have? this time what we're gonna Me pick, pick out. All right, let's try this one. All right, this one feels like a lucky number. Let's go. All right. 
This one's taped like pretty seriously. This one feels different too. This doesn't look the same. This one might be this guy. Let's see. No, it's not. Well, nope. who do we have? Somebody who looks like he's from Dragon Ball. That's what Oh, we there have. you go. <laughs> I don't know who this is. I'm sure you can tell me. He looks like a flower and a squid mixed together. Ah, you got virus or virus. All right, let's zoom in. There, there he is or she. And I actually haven't look at seen the, Look the, at the tentacles. There's detail. the tentacles, yeah. Little eyes. I mean, look at that face and tell me it doesn't look like Dragon Ball Z. It kind of does, huh? It, <laughs> is it the eye color? Is that it what it might, is? The it yellow and be. the orange? Yeah, it might be. The style of it? I don't know. Just the, the eye look, yeah. He stands that, really nice. That stare. That one stands really nice. Nice. That ten Those tentacles really help. It's like having a tripod. Ooh, yep. is his coloration a little bit different? No, it's is the, it the same. same as that gray one? Yeah. Okay. He stands super nice. Look at that. That one's the best one so far for standing. Yeah, look at that. That would so, be really easy to display later. Yeah. This is kind of neat there. It looks like they're all different. You have some gray ones, some brown ones. I'm curious the if the browns they're... look like they're slightly different toned as well. You know, this one's like a little more orange in this one. Oh yeah, interesting. And that's why I thought maybe this one had a little bit more white in it than the other one. If you yeah. look at the two bases, like yeah. this one looks like it has a little more, more white. white. Yeah, interesting. The cracks look a little, a little different. Yeah. I guess we'll find out as we get more open, see if uh, we get another gray one. Gray base to compare. And I'll pick this time. Okay. They hit him for me this time. Oh, this one's red. Oh, there you go. Oh, this one's crazy. He looks like a dragon. Woo! Look at that. That's one of these guys, isn't it? Yeah, this is the Super Gauss. So this is the 95 version. Yeah, look at that. Well, it definitely captured the Gauss look. Very red eyes, red claws, and even the tips of the wings. Super neat. The red goat matches well with your hair. Yeah, it sure does. <laughs> This one is not going to pose well. I can already tell there's like three <laughs> tiny points to lean him on. Let's see what we can do. Yeah, let's see if there's a different stand. Some of the flying ones have like a, something that like holds a little them peg up. or something. Yeah. Let's see. No. Uh, maybe. There, oh, there's a something. little hole. Yeah, there's a little hole on this mm -hmm. one. Right. Is there a rod or something? Plastic something? Yeah. Maybe this? Yeah, it looks like. All right, let, let me check this one out. Yeah, there looks like there's a hole right there. This stand, even though it's not the exact same, like it does look slightly different in terms of the coloration. Yeah. This one I feel like looks a little bit more metallic than the others. I, maybe I'm just making things up and I'm full of shit. <laughs> but, um, it looks a little different to me. Yeah. I don't know, it's got like a little bit more, I don't know if you, like, if you go back and forth, it looks a little bit more metallic to me. It kind of does. Like a slate. Huh? Yeah. Coming out, here it is. They really taped it tight in there. Okay. Here we go. Oh, it must hold him by the tail or something. I wonder how that sits. Let's All right, so we see. got we got the peg on the base. Oh, I think you got it before. Yeah, the other I think way. it's this way, right? Yep. Yeah. With a little diaper. <laughs> there you have it. Oh. Oops. <laughs> Almost. Trying. Trying. All right. There's <laughs> Super Gauss. All right, I'm going to slowly turn him around. You can see the big forehead. And really big forehead. See those red eyes. Those blood red eyes. Yeah. 
Yeah, so this guy loves to eat humans. Oh. So that's why we have Gamera, the guardian of the universe, to protect us. So that's how he's the friends of the children. Yeah, so in the 60s, he's called uh, friends of children. In the 90s, he's called the guardian of the universe. So he doesn't eat humans. No, he doesn't eat humans. What does he eat? He had to eat something to get that big. Good question. Maybe he eats these things. Oh, <laughs> Maybe fair. he eats the gals. Fair. <laughs> All right, another one to come. So how many do we have out here minus the two prototypes? Five, so... one, two, three, four, oh, six. All right, so we have six of the seven uh, normal figures. So let's see Normal if we figures, can... there's four special four, ones? Four chase figures. Ooh, this one's different too. Let's see what we got. Let's pop this open real quick, it's the easiest part. Oh, is it this guy? No, like... I don't think so. Um, he looks like light, maybe it's the plastic. Yeah, it's the same guy. Okay. Mm, sorry. That's all right. <laughs> <laughs> I got excited for nothing. No worries. Sorry for being excited. Well, that's why you get a full case. You know? <laughs> Nobody else gets that. <laughs> there you go. All right. Those. You want to take this one? Sure. Okay. I feel like it's one of those Christmas mornings and mom's watching me open all my <laughs> gifts. <laughs> and you don't know what's inside. I have right? no idea what's in them. <laughs> She's just sitting there like, I hope she likes it. Oh, okay, so we opened one of these red boys. I think we did, yes. All right. All right, we're hitting some of the clones. We're hitting some of, yeah, some duplicates. That's okay. Yep. Would you be surprised if you opened all these and you didn't get every single one in the set? I would be a little sad, but uh, don't worry. We have plenty in the garage. <laughs> <laughs> We got the squid boy. Yes, we got this boy. All right. All right, we're down to the last row. Which one would you like? Hmm. Let's go with this one. He's okay. sticking out a little bit already. All right. He was ready to pop open. The tape was nice and easy too. Let's go. There you go. Let's... I feel lucky about this one. All right. Let's see if we can finish up the normal ones, or maybe find a, a chase one. Uh oh, what do we have? The one of the green ones, I think, with the spiky shell. Let's see. Yeah, yeah might be the same. I think we opened him too. I think he, oh, this one has blood on his neck. Does this one have blood on his neck? This one might be different. You want to okay, take him out? Okay, we'll open him. Oh, oh. oh, he's got green on this oh, one. Oh, look at that. I hold think on, we hold on, we gotta show the green one. I think we found a chase. And what, so what is a chase? Chase is like those, um, like a chase figure. What do you call it? Like um, a secret figure. Like a secret. Uh, this is the base. It's got green something on it. Acid green grass. Blood. Come on. Does that work? Oh, maybe I zoomed in too much. There we go. Yeah, look at the green blood. Yeah, isn't that cool? K and Lin really makes uh, things special. So even the base is different than the uh, regular figures for the chase figure. But we almost passed on it because they did. He we'll does look very similar. <laughs> All right, let's... How did you see the blood on his neck? That's so little of a design difference. Yeah, look at that. And I think there's some on his hand, too. You're right, there yeah. is some. But the rest of it looks kind of the, the same. The same, right? Yeah. yeah. So it's really just the base and a little bit on his neck. And is that uh... like getting the shiny Pokemon? Is that exactly. like the special one? Exactly, yep, the special one. <laughs> the right, one let's... who doesn't want to stand up. I yeah, bet. so let's put these two side by side. We'll support each other. <laughs> Brothers. Yeah, so let's do a quick zoom in. We'll get another spin at this guy later on. Yeah. Okay, so we have a few more to open up. 
This is like the beefiest box opening video I've ever been a part of. <laughs> There's so many parts to it. Uh -huh. This one looks like it could be different. I'm not sure. All right, let's take a look. Oh, he looks pretty similar. Is he, to... is he upright? He is looks he like he's upright? upright like this. Okay. Like his so hands look different to I me. I think that might be the 9 to 5. His hands look different than the other ones, which would make me wonder if he's different. Yeah. And his his, his belly looks a little different too, I think. Like yeah. it's got more yellow, maybe? Okay. Or the pattern looks a little bit more emphasized. I could be crazy. <laughs> it's hard to tell. Mm -hmm. he, he looks like he's like... <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah, looks like 95. Yeah, he's That's different. That's different from the other ones? He is, yeah. <laughs> yeah, his hands are definitely a major part, and definitely his belly too, right? Yeah, this is one's more upright. I think that's usually the giveaway is for the 95. Is he the one looking like this? Yeah, so this is 96. Yeah, I knew his stomach looked different. Yeah, and I think the shell might be the, more green, right? The eyes are different. It's, it's more of like an olive, olive green. Olive green, yeah. yeah. Yeah, just how well defined. Look at the belly patterns, how well defined one is to the other. Yeah. Yep, there we go. Yep, you can see that the, the tusks are also uh, differently shaped. And how are the eyes? What do you think of the eyes? The eyes in this one? Is this the 95? This is 96. Is 96? Yeah. I like the 96 eyes a little better. The 95 eyes look a little... It's a little gremlin-y. Gremlin look to him. Yeah, like these ones are have a little, I don't know, they have a little bit more personality where this one's, I don't know, his eyes are kind of like... <laughs> <laughs> little evil thinking. I don't know, yeah, like, I don't know, he's a little strange looking. Yeah. I like his pose better. Oh, okay. I feel like he probably stands up a lot better because of his pose. Because of upright, yeah. Yeah, it, it's not leaning towards his face. Um, yeah. But he doesn't have any special fancy blood on the ground for this one. Nope. Interesting, because normally a uh, 95 camera is like super friendly looking, so they kind of change his character a little bit. <laughs> yeah, he looks definitely mischievous. Mm. Maybe he had enough uh, being, being a, good a goody, guy. Yeah, goody two shoe. All right, and uh, we do have 95 Super Gauss, so we can put those two to battle each other. All right, don't tip over, buddy. You can do it. <laughs> so how many of these on the board here are protagonists versus antagonists? So Gamera, which is the turtle, uh, th he's like the good guy. And then these three right here are the bad ones, so the villains. And we also have the two uh, big boys, or females actually. Uh, Legion and Iris. So... The pretty much collection we got going out yeah, here. Yeah, so pretty much all the turtles are good and all the non-turtles are bad. <laughs> I see, so it's like Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles. Yep. All right, how many boxes do we have left? Four. How many are we missing? Let's see, I think we got one chase and do we have one, two, three? Is it four, four chases? Five, six, seven. So we do have the full set of normal figures. Yes, there's four chases. We got one chase out and let's see what else we got in the box. I think this is one we just opened. You want to examine him Let's real quick? Let's take a peek. See if he's any different. I think he might be the same. I think he's the same too. Yeah. Any giveaway on the base? Any blood or no, anything? No. All right. Yeah, it's probably the same. Put him back in. You've only gotten a few duplicates. Yeah. Just which a is few. nice. It's nice that the duplicates are not the same ones over and over. It's yeah. just like one of each. Right. Yeah. Makes it probably easier to sell to the people who feel like they're not getting the same thing more than once. Yeah. All right, so there's three boxes left. We've got one chase out, so I'm hoping these are the last ones. And if they're not, you'll be sad. Uh-oh. We'll have to go into the garage. <laughs> <laughs> Ooh, this one might be different. It looks like it's got like some metallic paint, maybe. Ooh! Ooh, look at that. Ooh. That's cool. This one's got like a nice like neochrome paint to it. Hold on, hold on. All right. Ooh, look at the base. Oh, wow. Check that out. That's surprising. I didn't expect that. It's like pearlescent. Look at that. Isn't that neat? That's beautiful. You know this one's going to be good. Yeah. Oh, look, look at, at this paint. 
Look at that. Now, isn't that neat? Where's the... I hate to say he's like he's pretty because he's not supposed to be pretty, but he's so pretty. <laughs> yeah, look at that. Is it he's fully translucent or is he? Just he looks pearl? like he's fully translucent. Like he yeah. looks like he's mostly clear with the pearlescent coloring on him. Yeah, and just paint on the eyes and the mouth. I think right. Yeah. Everything else. Everything is else like, is like translucent. Like a pearl color. He can stand here with his buddy, the best standers around. There you go. We'll move these two away so we can... Wow, look at that paint. Even yeah. the base is like a, like a pink green. Yeah, that's cool. Like, yeah, I get, you know, Kay and Lynn really puts emphasis on making it unique and special. So even the base is different. So uh, very rare do you see that. And here's the, I guess you call it the standard, the normal one. Put these two side by side. Cool stuff. I like that the body's mostly pink and like with green shimmers and the ground is mostly green with pink shimmers if you look at it right. It looks like it's like reverse. Yeah. Very cool. That's my favorite one so That's far. That's your favorite one? Yeah, right. the paint really has has blown me away on that one. Awesome. This box is being a little difficult. Mm -hmm. Ooh, this one might be a different colored guy. Ooh, I think it's a red one. A oh, red look turtle. look at that. A red turtle. Ooh, open this one. This one looks neat. Wow, look at this base. Your base looks multicolor AF. Yeah. Wow. Look at that. This is cool. This is really pretty. Yeah. Zoom in on them a little bit. There you go. Look at that. Yeah, we don't get any, I don't think we have any, uh, or maybe very few figures of uh, the, you know, the, the Papa Gamera from 2006. But yeah, this base is really well done. It looks like it's like the burn mark, like the kind of like the glowing fire. And I think this is like the, like the, his final moments where he self, uh, self-destructs to kill all the hyper gauss so uh, he's all kind of like he sort has of a like yellow mark kind of... over his eye yeah oh he has a yellow mark look at that yeah it's kind of like burning godzilla in the 95 movie where he's kind of all in this orangey and yellow uh color pattern yeah i really love the paintwork that one's really different yeah very cool so here's the normal one put these two side by side Put these two there. Oops, knocking everybody, <laughs> knocking everybody over. <laughs> They're like a bunch of toddlers who can't hold their own heads up. Yeah. All right, let's put these two here. We'll take a look at these two while you open that box. Very neat. Yeah, I do see that yellow, uh, yellow scar on the eye. That's kind of neat. I think this one's different too. I think it's got green all over his head. Oh, okay. Let's check this one out. Come on, you can come out of there. There we go. All right. Is this the last this one? This is the last one. The very last one. So we have a full set and some extras. This is a similar base. The other one has green on it. Yeah, it looks like some. Maybe uh, a little more green than the other one. Yeah. See if I can zoom in on this thing. Oh yeah, he's got like a like bloody head a little bit. Oh okay, let's see. Ooh, there's a lot of blood. Oh, there we go. Yeah, it's like blood all over him. Poor camera. <laughs> it's probably not his blood. <laughs> he's probably doing the smashing. No, actually, that's th that's his blood. So Gamera does bleed green. Um, so uh, in this, in the '95 movie, he was fighting uh, all the. There's like a bunch of these Gauss, and they shoot like a hypersonic uh, like laser beam. And it gets cut up pretty badly in that movie. I do really like that red and yellow one too. I took it back when I said he was my favorite. He's my favorite paint job. That's not 
standard paint job, but mm -hmm. this one's my favorite paint job of like the normal looking colors. Ah, uh, yeah. I tend to I tend to be like, oh, Neochrome's really cool, but yeah, it's very different because you don't see too many of the other ones in the box are like that. Yeah. He's the only one of the whole series that's like that, which makes him stand out. Stand out, right? Yeah. I almost wish they made a turtle like that. All right. Well, thank you, Ryu, for uh, joining us on this uh, camera uh, unboxing. We definitely had a bunch of these little guys. Well, thanks for having me. I had a whole lot of fun, and I learned a lot of things from you today. Yeah. <laughs> so hopefully we can have you again in future videos. I would love to. And uh, a lot of fun, cool stuff. Oh, well, thanks for having me. Again, I'm Ryu here with uh, SG. Uh, G Forever. Yeah. G Forever. Yep. <laughs> <laughs> I'm terrible at learning people's handles. <laughs> no worries. Yeah, if you want to shout out to uh, any of your social um, uh, media or anything, uh, feel free. Uh, so you could just find me anywhere, like Facebook, Instagram, TikTok. I don't really use TikTok a lot, but like my name is Ryu Lav, it's everywhere. R Y U U L A V is in Victor, I T Z is in Zebra. It's really a mouthful. <laughs> you can find me anywhere. Yeah, she makes awesome stuff, so I definitely do a lot check of cosplay stuff. I actually saw someone do a Godzilla cosplay one time oh. that I was like really inspired by. So maybe someday, if you someday, get me into the right? franchise, maybe yeah. I'll do the blue one that you have upstairs. There you go. That would be awesome. Yeah, I mean, look at him. He is fantastic. <laughs> nice. Yeah. I'm surrounded by Godzilla. Sorry, it's very distracting. <laughs> I think you might need to do the blue hair next, right? <laughs> Blue doesn't stay in my hair the way no? that red does. Okay. No, the red stays. So I'll have to find a Godzilla that's red then. We do, right behind you. <laughs> Shin so Godzilla, many of them. right? <laughs> yeah, we'll definitely have a red. We have we just did the Furious Red by Easy Hobby Omega Beast series as well. So look at him, he's so cute. Get some. <laughs> Alright. Buy some. Alright, so this is G Forever and a special guest with Ryu. And uh, we'll ch hopefully you'll enjoy all the Easy Hobby Gamera minifigures, as well as the Omega Beast Gigantic Gamera, 1999. Thanks for hanging out, guys. See you later.